Here's another question that relates to statistical process control or in other words uh, SPC. The question goes like this. A control chart was created by a person which has mean, upper specification limits and lower specification limits. Is this the correct way of creating control charts? The options that we have are straightforward, yes or no. Now in order for you to understand the answer this question, you need to have a very basic understanding of control charts. Control charts are nothing but uh, they represent the variation which is there in the process. So the limits that we see on the control charts on the upper side and the lower side of the mean is nothing but the spread or the variation from the data and it has nothing to do with what the customer wants you to achieve. Right? The term specification limits usually are associated with customers that is customer specifies to you what he expects he or she expects and then you try to achieve that through your process. So in control charts we don't use specification limits in fact we use what is called as upper control limits and lower control limits that is UCL and LCL and they represent the variation or they are derived from the variation which is there inherent variation which is there in the process. So the option here is B which is no because he has used specification limits.